Oh, hello. Hello, class. Good night, class. How are you today? Good night. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hi class, how was your weekend? Was this a good weekend? Did you have fun? What did you do? Let's go, Charla. How much tools finish? Good. Was it good? Okay, nice. What did you do? Uh, for me, it's okay. I okay. cook a cake. With my mom. Really? You bake it? Yes, you bake it? You bake it? Yes, yes. I make wow. it. Wow. Excellent. Good evening. Hello, hello. Don't forget to write your full name, to have your camera on, and to participate. Don't be afraid to participate and to make questions, okay? This is what I like from you. To participate. So we are going to start the class here. Do you remember the topic from Friday? No, from Thursday. ¿Se acuerdan el tema del jueves? Yes. What was the topic? Yes. Um, uh, the day is week. Huh? Days week. Okay. But no, the last topic. El último tema que vimos. A ver si practicamos. The simple, okay. the simple present sta statements. Very good. Simple present statements. We were making questions. Okay. Questions. Affirmative, negative. And the last class we were making questions. Okay. And you know, for this uh, section, section number three, we are going to use WH questions as well. También la vamos a ocupar. Siguen las WH questions, okay? So I'm just missing Joanna, Roxana, Eric. Juan. Cameras on, please. Cameras on all the time and participate, okay? This is so important, okay? Excellent, there you go. Cameras on all the time. Here we go. So what day is today? Today is? Monday, March. Um, Monday, March. 21. 21st. Uh, uh, 2022. 2022, okay? So practice. So the topic for today, let me show you. It's a very interesting topic. It's mostly vocabulary. In this class, we are going to introduce a lot of vocabulary. So you can practice. Section number three vocabulary okay don't forget to write it down in your notebook <clears throat> give me a here we go okay let's start with the class we are going to start with section number three and by the way let me ask you Si se fijan, hoy no tengo los headsets. No los tengo a la mano. I forgot my headsets. ¿Se puede escuchar bien? ¿Se escucha claro? ¿Necesito hablar más fuerte? ¿Cómo se escucha? Yes. Yes. Clear and loud. Loud and clear. Okay. Yeah. It's okay. So, section number three. What do you do? What do you do? We are going to use this question when we want to find out about people's occupation. What do you do? For example, if you class ask me, hey, what do you do? I am a teacher. I work as a teacher. ¿Qué hacen? ¿De qué trabajan? What do you do? Okay. What do you do? And we have jobs, vocabulary for session number five for today, for Monday. Don't forget my name, teacher Elena Argueta. Maybe some of you forgot about my name, but that's again. Es otra vez mi nombre, cualquier cosa, escríbanme. Gracias a los que estuvieron consultando y a los que les pude ayudar esta semana. Okay, so here we go. What 
do you do? Jobs, vocabulary. So we are going to move on to the platform. Let's go and check the platform. Look, jobs, vocabulary, and activities. Let's watch this video and let's practice vocabulary, okay? Here we go. The first time, listen, and then we are going to repeat. On vocabulary. Okay, let me go back. Here we go. Hi, everyone. In this class, you learn vocabulary. For si se escucha? Yes. Yes. Okay. Very good. Very good. Also practice describing the activities that different jobs do. Let's get started by listening and practicing the vocabulary. One. He's a receptionist. Two. She's a doctor. Three. She's a nurse. Four. He's a pilot. Five. She's a flight attendant. Six. He's a musician. Seven. She's a singer. Eight. She's a judge. Nine. He's a police officer. Ten. He's a lawyer. Okay. Eleven. He's a cook. He's a chef. Twelve. He's a waiter. Thirteen. She's a waitress. Fourteen. He's a salesperson. Fifteen. She's a cashier. And the last sixteen. She's a security guard. Okay, once again, let's go back. Let's listen and repeat. Practice the vocabulary. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn vocabulary for common jobs. <clears throat> Additionally, you'll also practice describing the activities that different jobs do. Let's get started by listening and practicing the vocabulary. One, he's a receptionist. Okay, take a look at this picture. We have this man, receptionist. Where can you find a receptionist? Where can you find a receptionist? And then they come from in a hospital or a office. A, if you go to a hospital, a hotel, hotel, not really. Ese tiene otra palabra. Not in a hotel. Okay, hospital. If you go to uh, any in the business office, any kind of business, you are going to find a receptionist <clears throat> what are some of the activities that a receptionist uh, or receptionist do is attend to the person when when i go to the whatever place mm -hmm. do they take calls write emails what do they do receptionist que hacen que actividades hacen los receptionists Similar to secretaries. Okay, maybe so similar, but mm, there is a difference. Secretaries, most of the time, reception inside of an office, and they don't take care of people. Ellos no se encargan de recibir nada. Ellos están trabajando en un office. Pero receptionists, they welcome people. They say hi. How can I help? They take some call, they write emails. So those are receptionists. That's Two, she's a doctor. She's a doctor. Ah, so he is a receptionist at a hospital. No, she is a doctor. Doctor, we can use this word, this noun for men and for women. Doctor. He is a doctor. She is a doctor. Three. She's a nurse. Nurse is the same. Men, women. Okay. 
North. Four. He's a pilot. Five. She's a flight attendant. Okay, now let's move on to the second picture. We have pilot, flight attendant. Pilot, flight attendant. Where do they work? On yes, Sandra. In an airport. I... At the airport. Excellent. Pilot, flight In the, the attendant. Mm -hmm. They have different roles. Pilot, he planes the airplane. Flight attendant, she um, takes care of people inside of the airplane. Okay, let's move on to the next picture. Six, he's a musician. Seven, she's a singer. Musician and singer. Can you mention famous singers in El Salvador? Famous singers in El Salvador. Do, do we have famous singers here in El Salvador or not? For example, Alvaro Torres. Ah, oh, Alvaro Torres is a well-known singer. Yeah, Alvaro Torres. He's not been in El Salvador, right? No. He's in Estados Unidos. Ah, so he lives in United States, but he's a famous Salvadorian singer. Any other singer from El Salvador? No, right? Not in that. Not in that de los hermanos Flores. Exactly, Hermano Flores. They are really famous. Well, and she sings really well. Exactly. Or any famous singer around the world. Mention singers or which singers do you like? Sam Smith. Oh, wow. Interesting. Any other? Celine Dion. Celine Dion, right. Excellent. She's a great singer. Adele. Adele. Yeah, exactly. No more? Speak. Shakira. <laughs> Shakira. She's a great dancer and singer. Mark so. Miller, Snow Dogg, Dr. Dre. Snow Dogg, Dr. Dre. Exactly. Uh, Jay Z. Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So singers, singers. We can use this word for male and female. Lo mismo. Hombres y mujeres. Singer, singer. Okay. And musician. Musician, people who plays an instrument. In this case, look at this picture. This musician, what is he playing? ¿Qué está tocando? This musician. Piano. piano. Is playing the piano. This musician is playing Play the piano. Next. Eight. Picture. She's a judge. Nine. He's a police officer. 10. He's a lawyer. Okay. Judge. Police officer and lawyer. Judge. Police officer and lawyer. Do we have lawyers in this class? Lawyers. Do I have lawyers in this class? No. No tengo abogado. No, 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 yes. Or I am a student. Excellent. Ana Maria is going to be or to become a lawyer. Y va a ser una abogada. Muy bien. Or maybe in your family, do you have a relatives who are lawyers? No. No. Not really. Okay. How about judge? Judge. Not right, and then I have friend that is George. Okay, and police officer or police man, police officer, police man. Let's continue. Eleven. He's a cook. He's a chef. Twelve. He's a waiter. Thirteen. 
She's a waitress. Okay, at a restaurant, he is a chef or what is the other way to say chef in English? Cook. Mm -hmm. Cook. Carlos Alberto Villalobos, how do we say chef? Or what is another way to say chef in English? Uh, cook. Cook, exactly, cook. For example, let me see. Can you mention famous cook here in El Salvador? No? We, do we have famous cook or chef here in El Salvador? Chef Cuvilla. Ah, Chef Cuvilla, he was like excellent, excellent cook. Any other? There's a woman, hay una mujer bien famosa. No? Uh, she don't need. Olga Mirana. She don't, she Olga don't Mirana. Make, she don't make pupusas. No, 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 please don't get pupusas from Olga Mirana. It's right? a terrible, it's a terrible. <laughs> yeah, I still remember those pupusas, right? But we don't know. Put in the, 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 the cheese and the, and the pupusas. So it's a, it's a terrible. Yeah, that's a that. Let's don't talk about famous people here in El Salvador. Yeah, we can ask questa, but no. Yeah, she's she's a she's a cook. Ella también es una chef or a cook. Muy bien. Very good. Let's continue. Ah, and then we have a waiter, waitress, waiter, waitress. For example, if you go to a restaurant, if you go to Pollo Campero, Pizza Hut, you are going to find waiters and waitress. So in this case, we made a distinction. We make a distinction, okay? Entre hombre y mujer hacemos la distinción. No como las palabras anteriores que pueden ser para ambos. Waiter, it's for men or women. Waiter. Very good. How about waitress? Woman. Okay, woman. Okay, or mujeres. Mujer or mujer. Excellent. 14. He's a salesperson. Salesperson. 15. She's a cashier. 16. She's a security guard. Salesperson, cashier, security guard. Salesperson, cashier, security guard. Security guard. The salesperson is like uh, when you walk in a seaman, so you look at the people, the sell, sell person. Exactly, you know, in great, there is a difference between Sales person and people. No, I mean vendor. Look at this one, class. Veamos esta observación. Muy buena observación. Me encanta porque la vamos a ver en el vocabulario. Sales person and vendor. Let's write it with capital. So, what is the difference? But in English, try to say that in English, okay? Salesperson, vendor. Who do we call salesperson and who do we call vendor? ¿Cuál es la diferencia en clase? Vamos. I, I think that yes, go. the vendor is like, uh, for example, the people who walk in the street and vendor and whatever, so they knock the door and offers whatever, I don't know, so whatever things, okay. or anything. And so the person is like, uh, for example, when you walk in and uh, whatever store and you look at the person walk uh, around the store. But actually they are doing the same role. Both are self uh, persons, self people. You know, let me, for a very clear example, um, Marlon was telling us, if you go to Siman, you are going to find a lot of 
sales people. What is the, the role? They need to sell. Les pagan para vender. They need to sell. Si no venden. Bye bye. No receive money. But in, on the other hand, vendor. For example, if you want to get some fruit. Si vamos al mercado y queremos comprar fruta. Ah, encontramos a vendor. Because clients come to the vendor. Los clientes venden hacia el vendor. Él solo está ahí con su puesto vendiendo. ¿O creen ustedes que tiene que ir y ofrecer por todo el mercado? No, él está ahí vendiendo, si es cierto. Pero los clientes vienen al vendor. El salesperson, he goes and sells. For example, if I want to buy a car, I need to get a car. I go and a salesperson is going to give me details about the car, about the colors, the benefits that I have, and he's going to try to sell me that car. But if I want to get some fruit, some stuff, I go and get it from a vendor. That is the difference. Si esta clara la idea de vendor and salesperson class? Si esta clara? Si? El vendor, los clientes vienen a mí. Ok, y vendo, claro que es mi acción también vender, pero los clientes vienen. Salesperson, yo voy y me rebusco para hacer la venta. Ok, yo vendo, ofrezco, ofrezco. Entonces, veamos esa diferencia, le llamamos diferentes, ok? Salesperson and vendor. And we have cashier, cashier people who gets the money, okay? For example, if you go to the supermarket, you are going to pay to the cashier, cashier. Muy bien. And, ¿cuál era la última? Security guard, security guard. It's people who is standing at a bank, store or any other place and he takes care of people inside of the store and employees. Security guard, un guardia de seguridad. Él cuida de las personas inside of the store and people who work there, okay? So let me find out about this one. Do you remember the vocabulary we just watched? Who can mention five different words related to work? Waiter. Waiter. Uh, pilot. Pilot. ¿Qué más recuerda? Yes. Selling yes. assistant. Yes. Selling person. Selling person. Doctor, doctor, flight attendant. Continue. Uh, cook. cook. Chef. Oh. Chef. Yes. 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 Lawyer. Lawyer. Security. Security guard. Security guard. guard. Police, Police, Police officer. Police officer. Okay, so let's make a pause. Pasemos la lista ahorita, okay? So, que veo que algunos me están escribiendo que si la clase no ha comenzado. Sí, comenzó. Bien, here we go. If you listen to your name, you are going to say uh, here or present. Vamos a ver. Let me look for If you hear, you're going to say here or present. Give me a second, nine to 10. Okay, I'm ready. By the way, did you complete activities from section one and two? Yes. Si, ¿Sí? alguien tuvo problemas para enviar la, las actividades, chicos? Oh. Teacher, a mí solo en una uh -huh. tarea fue de que la, la hice este, varias veces una pregunta en el, creo que fue en el 2, pero no la hacía de una forma, no me la aceptaba, la hacía de otra. Entonces, por esa, esa, 
esa palabra, me quedó, no me quedó este, la puntuación completa, ¿verdad? Si no completa, estoy, ajá. Okay. No baja, pero no me recuerdo ahorita. Igual a mí en la... ¿En qué parte fue? <coughs> Vaya, voy a primera... cambiar a quien le aparece cero todavía para decirles qué pasa y que veamos qué, qué podemos hacer. Pero yo sí hice porque me dijeron que la actividad de... Hasta el 2, ¿verdad? Hasta el... Yes, exactly. Section 1 and 2. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Bien, aquí estamos. So, here we go. Y yo le cambié varias veces porque dije, tal vez me he equivocado y nada, no me la aceptaron. Me ah, imagino que es la misma que me consultó Jorge, ¿verdad, Jorge? ¿Cuál tú me estabas consultando? ¿Cuál era? Sección... I guess it's the same. Creo que es la misma. Se me olvidó anotarla. Yo casi siempre anoto las cosas, pero... ¿Qué sección era, olvidé. Jorge, la que estábamos resolviendo, que tenías tu problema? Let me check. Let Please. Me check. Okay. okay, mientras tanto, toma la asistencia. Adriana González. Very good. Ana Karina. Present. Okay, Ana María. Eh, present, pero yo escuché que había otra Ana María, no sé si... si... No, I have Ana Karina en Ana María. Ah, uh, ok. So don't worry. Carlos Alberto Cabrera. Present. Ok, Carlos Alberto Villalobos. Yeah. Cristian Adonai. Cristian Adonai. Cristelia Rosalina. Here, teacher. Cristian Alberto. Present. Edgar Francisco. Yes, Present. Excellent. Edgar Isaac. Edgar Isaac Mayen. Ok. Eric Sigifredo. Present. Jennifer Mercedes Hernández. Present. Ok, excelente. Joaquín Antonio Chévez. Ok. Joana Beatriz Rivas. Here. Excelente, Joana. Jorge Alberto Hernández. Present. Okay. Juana Beatriz. Present, teacher. José Armando Hernández. José Armando is. Ok. Catherine Larisa. Present. Kevin Alexander. Here, teacher. Okay. Marlon Ovidio. Present. Rebecca Abigail. René Eduardo. Roxana Beatriz. Antes de que mencionara esos dos Eso. nombres, ¿cómo se llama la, la que tiene camisa como floreada? Which one? ¿Cuál? ¿Cuál, Marlon? No sé cómo se llama. Cámaras on, please. Oh. Bien, oh, bien. Let me see. Estaba con Roxana Beatriz. Present. Muy bien. Samuel Eduardo. Present. Sandra Cecilia. Present. And Yesenia Claribel. Rebeca, yo no sé si está desde una computadora o tiene unos parlantes, pero cuando activo el micrófono, de ella es la interferencia. En Rebe. Yeah. Rebe. Sí, ajá. ¿Qué será Rebe? Se oye feo. No sé si es. Una interferencia. No sé ah, si es la, la, la entrada de, lo, de los parlantes. Puede ser. O no sé. 
Bueno, no sé, no sé. Tal vez Rebe nos podrá decir después. Bien, cameras on, please. So, aquí estamos. Bien, los mencioné a todos, ¿sí? Sí, clase. Bien. So, let's continue. Vocabulary. In this class, we are just going to practice vocabulary related to jobs. So, let me take a look at this one. We are going to work in this activity. We have so many jobs. Some of them are similar to the video we just watched. And we have some others. For example, look at this one. I was mentioning this. Les estaba haciendo emphasis in this one. P and, let me see, se lo selección, this one. Vendor, letter P, and where is the other one? Salesperson, salesperson, where is it? Do we have salesperson in this list? I guess we don't. Yeah, we do. Aquí está. The term. So, L, salesperson and vendor. Don't forget the difference. And we have this other one, server. Server, in this case, is similar to waiter or waitress. Server, server, okay? We also have front desk clerk. That is not the same as a receptionist. Front desk clerk. Where can we find a front desk clerk? And what are the differences? Si no, yo les ayudo, okay? What is front desk clerk? Okay, let's give you a... Uh, Clue, let me give you a clue. Look at this man, number 10. Miren el 10. ¿Qué será el receptionist or front desk clerk? And front desk clerk. Number desk seven. Clerk. Look at number seven. He is a receptionist. He's a receptionist. Mm -hmm. So where can we find front desk clerk? Where can we find him? ¿A dónde encontramos este tipo de personas? Miren qué lugar es ese. Es un hotel. Hotel, exactly. Hotel. So, what is his role? He's just greeting people, helping people. Pero miren el número siete. ¿Qué está haciendo él? He's inside of an office. He's taking calls. He has a computer in front of him. He's writing maybe a message. I don't know. So, that is the difference. Front desk clerk, it's at a hotel. And take a look at uh, number 11. Miren el número 11. ¿Qué será él? Host. His name. Miren el 11. 11. 11. It's a G? No. Ah, uh -uh. No. I don't know what is this. Or in Spanish, how do we say botones? El botone. El botone. And how do we say botones? <laughs> Pero no sé cómo se dice en inglés. <laughs> Ahora vamos a decir. Es casher. No, B. No. Bell. Bell hop. Bell hop. Bell hop. Le suena esa relación de bell. What is bell? Bell hop. Es una campana. Botones. Campana. Se han fijado que para llamar al botón es que tenemos que sonar. Yeah. Campanita. Una campanita. <laughs> campanita, exactly. So, mm. Bellhop is carrying the luggage. So, Bellhop, man, descubrimos muchas nuevas palabras. So, Bellhop, any other that you don't recognize? ¿Qué otra no reconocen para aclarar? ¿O todas están claras? ¿Todas están. Eh, ¿Se entiende? Yeah. A cash. Cashier, cashier, cashier. What letter? I don't know. What letter don't know. is it? C. Cashier. Ah, letter C. Cashier. C. For example, if you go to a uh, super selectors, you are going to pay to the cashier. ¿A quién le pagamos en el super selectos? Uh, cajero. 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 Okay. En el banco what tenemos is... muchos cashiers. What is letter cost? Is Allergy. Hust. For mm -hmm. example, if you are going to have a birthday party at home, you are going to celebrate a birthday party at home. 
you are going to receive. Ajá, ustedes reciben a los invitados, entonces a ustedes se les llama host. I'm the host. ¿Cómo traducimos eso entonces? Host. Anfitrión. Anfitriones, muy bien. Ustedes tienen una fiesta en casa, la casa de ustedes, los invitados vienen a ustedes, ustedes son el host, anfitrión. Esa palabra la usamos mucho en Zoom también, host. House. You are. Host. You are host. In this case, ¿quién sería yo en esta reunión, en esta sala? Host. 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 ¿Y ustedes qué, en qué se convierten? Co. Host. Co. Si alguien le doy el rol. Host. Co. Host. So that is host. So what are we going to do? I'm going to give you five minutes. I guess it's enough. So you can get together in group. You are going to watch these pictures. Try to associate the vocabulary with the picture. For example, number one. What letter corresponds to number one? Me? J. Picture one, letter J. Picture two. Damos la letra correcta. ¿Sí está claro lo que vamos a hacer, clase? Yes. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. Yes. Letter A, B, C, D, E, F. Todo eso, ¿ok? So, here we go. I'm going to share this to Facebook. No, no, Facebook. Come on, teacher. To WhatsApp. Let me share it again. Please, let me know if you can watch uh, the picture. Ven la imagen, chicos. Can you watch? No. No. Oh, no. Not again. Cambiar otro grupo. Ustedes son grupo 9, 10. Here we go. Give me a second. Okay. Ahí estamos. Here we go. Did you get the picture? Yes. yes. Very good. Here we go. You can join the groups right now. Don't forget to practice your English, okay? Participate. There you go. I'm just missing Cristelia, Christian, and Ana Maria, and Roxana. Did you get the invitation, Cristelia? Yes, Roxana, Christian, and Ana Maria. There you go, Roxana. How about you, Joanna? Room number one, Joanna. Okay. And Roxana, go to room number two. Room number two, okay. Excellent, Joanna. Did you get the invitation, Roxana? Si sí, apareció la invitación, Roxana. Sala número dos. Yes. There you go. Mentor. Okay, don't forget to practice your English. For example, number one, letter J, number two, letter, and so on. Practice your English, please. Number four, letter A, number, number three, the vendor, letter P, letter P. Don't forget yes. to practice your English, okay? For example, number one, letter J, number two, letter, and so on. Mm -hmm. 
No, no, no. No escucho nada, amor. ¿Can you? ¿Ahora sí, Juana? Nada, no escucho nada, no sé qué pasó. No tengo el... ¿Qué have about Adriana y Kevin? Are you there? I am here. Yes. Excellent. So, who's going to start? ¿Quién va a empezar? Okay, go. Uh, Ladies first or boys first? Yo tengo duda en la en el número cuatro, no sé. No, okay. Number four. This one. The saddest person? Yes. Yeah, mm -hmm. number four. Look. Look at this woman. This woman. ¿Qué está haciendo ella? Está recibiendo a los invitados. ¿Cómo se le llama a ella? Uh, es... A gold coach. Hust. 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 Excellent. Love. There you go. Continue. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Ajá. Uh -huh. eh, la four, no sabemos cuál, cuál es. Ah, okay, look at this woman. What is she doing? She's saying, welcome. You can come in to this restaurant. ¿Qué está haciendo ella? Le está dando la bienvenida. Ah, so how do we go to this lady? Host. Host. There you go, Ana Maria. Excellent. Host. Yes, host. You're welcome. So go ahead and continue. Five. Five is Sales. Ah, no. It's a server. This meeting is being recorded. Speaking, speaking, speaking. Did you finish? Um, no? No, no. Okay, but you can't compare. Okay, Sandra, ask your classmate. Number two, for example, number one, letter A. Number two, letter. Where we we going to? Uh, uh, number nine. Uh, number. We compare the others numbers. Then number nine. For me, the number Hi. nine. Is I. I, yes. And uh, the third is. I put F. Yes. Um, Eleven is and the letter and B. Yes, me too. Excellent okay. job. Excellent job, class. And English number four, <laughs> a Spanish. No, you can do it, class. I know. A sheer. Let me nine. Nine is uh, office manager. Kind of. Yeah. I think that. Is a la nueva. Of your manager. Mm -hmm. And ten. Yes. And ten is. Oh, significa anfitriona. That's right. Sí. Uh 
What is a ten? Letter F. But is there from the the squares? Ten. Uh, yes. Eleven. From from the square. The number ten. F. Time to go back. Did you finish? Yeah. Yes, you did. Excellent. I'm done. How was it? Is it difficult to identify? So only I need to remember the different, the personality, but Okay. Um, I think that is easy. So it's easy. Okay, excellent. How about the other? So, what do you think about you? I wanted to try to apply um on whatever call center. So because I like to attend person and tech support. So okay. the problem is when I try to apply. So um I don't I don't. Uh, I don't, don't feel confident. Keep, I don't keep to conversation with the different people. So uh, I don't have this because I I feel so much nervous or uh, because I feel forget old when I try to explain. So whatever ask us mm -hmm. yeah, so I don't know. But I think sometimes I think that I I have confidence. And I think that, yeah, I can do it. So only need to try and breathe. But when I, when I be when in this, uh -huh. when I be this moment, so I forget old. So I don't know. Yeah, I recommend you to go and try. Don't be okay. confidence. That's the piece. Don't forget confidence. If you're confident enough, you're going to do it. They can say yes, they can say no. If they say no, go and try it again. Try it and try it and try it, okay? So don't be afraid. That's English, okay? The same for you, class. Don't be afraid to participate. ¿Qué es lo más que yo les puedo decir? No, do it again. Do it again, okay? No tengan miedo de participar en inglés. Para eso es esta clase, okay, chicos? So, Marlon, I know you can do it. Go and try. I know you can do it. Okay. You should watch some videos, you know, at YouTube. Hay tantos videos que te recomiendan como hacerlo. En free, my friend. You don't pay, okay? So do it. Okay? Class, did you finish? Yes, no? Yeah. Okay, we check the vocabulary. Yeah. Picture number yes. one. Picture number one. Wow, look at that. We have Jay. What is she doing? What is the police officer doing? She writing ticket. ticket. She's writing a ticket. Why? ¿Por qué crees que escriben un ticket? Why is she writing a ticket? Because you do you fragment. <laughs> Do you know this one? Let me help you. He's she's writing a ticket because of this one. Porque está parqueado enfrente de un. I don't know. Say this. ¿Cómo se... How do you say that one? Huh? Claro, how do you say that one? How do you say hidrante in English? Go ahead and look for it now. Busquémoslo. Un minuto para buscarlo. Extra vocabulary. It's quite similar to Spanish. Hidrante. Yeah, uh -huh, exactly. There you go. That's the pronunciation, exactly. It's similar to Spanish. So, 
Look at this police officer. She's writing a ticket. ¿Qué esa acción se llama? Writing a ticket. Está poniendo una esquela. Ticket en inglés. Ticket. She's writing a ticket. And this ticket is not for a concert. Mm -mm. It's not for a concert. This is a ticket because uh, he was parking in the incorrect place. It's an obstruction. Exactly. Number two, number two. How do we call this man? What is his job about? Number two. Taxi, yeah, taxi, taxi driver. driver. Taxi driver. Taxi driver or have driver, taxi driver of cab driver. Or we can also call him Uber driver or any other name, right? But taxi driver. Then we have bread sales. Whoa, he's selling bread sales. Who is selling bread sales? Vendor. Vendor. Yeah, there you go. He's a vendor. Vendor. So what letter is it? P. Letter? P. P. Let me see. Exactly. P. So we have J and P. They are gone. Ya tenemos letter J and P. Take a look at the other picture. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Why don't you correct me? Porque no me. Tienen la dos que puse. It's not letter J. What is the correct no. one? The letter O. Oh. O. Oh, you see? I'm a distracted girl. Corrijan siempre. No dejen que. Si yo me equivoco, no me corrijan. Corrijan. J O P. Next one. We have a, a restaurant. Four, five, six. I need to listen to the correct uh, vocabulary. Number four. Four sales person. Letter L. Sales Oh, for salesperson. No. What is she selling? For ¿Qué está haciendo ella? Salesperson. No. For is host. Host. Salesperson or host? Host. 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 What letter is it? Oh. Is G. 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 No la lean como ghost. Así se lee, pero no es host. Exactly, hast. Why? Because she's receiving people. She's saying welcome to this restaurant. Number five. What is his, what is his job? Server. 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 Where is and letter N. Ah, letter N. And then we have right here, look at this one. Yes. These people preparing some food. Chef. This is chef. 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 Or, chef. Or, or, chef. Or, or cook. Or cook. Chef of our cook. Excellent job. So let's have O. Ready? P, vendor, G, host, and server, and letter D. Where is it? Chef. Very good. Let's continue. Next picture. Seven, eight, and nine. Go ahead, class. Seven, eight, and nine. Receptionist. Receptionist. Lobo, Sandra, Jorge, I need to participate, okay? Who else? Samuel, Eric, Adriana. I want to listen to you, class. Kevin, Joanna, Carlos Cabrera, Rosana, everybody participating now. Seven, eight, and nine. Go ahead. Seven, receptionist. Receptionist. Reception. Oh, there you go. A. A. No, receptionist. K. I hear A. K. Letter K. A. 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 Content. Account. 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 Account.
Eight. Yes. Letter A. And look at this happy. Oh. He's a wild, right? Oh. Number nine. Yes, an of, uh, office uh, manager. Uh, it's the office manager. Imagine working with this lady. Now, really, I don't really like it. I, she's not happy. K, A, and I. K, A, and I. Okay. K, A, I. Uh, office manager. Next picture, we have 10 and 11. 10 and okay. Front desk clear. Front desk clear. What letter is it? F. F. Front desk clear. F and? Mm -hmm. F. B. 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 So, what are we missing? B. 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 ¿Cuáles nos sobran, clase? Cashier. 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 But why? Because I have another picture. That's why. Porque tengo otra imagen. Let me. Oops. It's this one. So this is going to be easier. Picture number one. Picture number one, 12, 13. Easy. Easy class. Mm -hmm. 12. 12. Nurse. 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 Oh, nurse. Don't forget mm -hmm. that nurse, it can be for men as well. Nurse. H. And we have next to this. Doctor. 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 He is a doctor. Oh. He is a doctor. Mm. Okay. 14. Look at this. Um, yeah, this girl, she's trying to sell a suit. A this person. This person. This person. person. She is a salesperson. 15. This lady in red, she's giving a package. She's, she's getting money. She's getting paid. And the last one. Security. Security, oh, security guard. Security, security guard. Security guard. 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 Security guard. So, questions about pronunciation, meaning of this vocabulary? It's about vocabulary? No? Questions about this? Is it clear? Yeah, it's clear. Yes, it is. Tan claro como el agua, como los chatos. So, go ahead and check the platform. What do we have here? You know, for the class, we only have vocabulary. But tomorrow we are going to practice making sentences. But if you know how to do it, you can go ahead and complete this one. He is a receptionist. She is a doctor. She is a nurse. But look, they are using the short form. Están usando la forma contractada. He's a receptionist. She's a doctor. She's a nurse. Let's complete just number four and number five because of the time. What his job, number four. What do we say? He's a pilot. He's a pilot. He's a pilot. Very good. He's a pilot. <laughs> Hear it at the end. What's her job? She's a pilot. Mm -hmm. Flight. 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 And you go on and go on and go on. He's a musician. He's a singer. She's a, singer. She's a judge. 
He is a police officer. Yes. He is a lawyer. He is a cook, a chef. He is a waiter. He is a waiter. He is a salesperson. She is a cashier. He is a security guard. Okay. Questions about this exercise? Yes. Yes, if not, no. you know, don't worry. Yes. We are going to do this tomorrow. But if not, yes, tell me, Ana Maria. Antes que nos vayamos, no hay problema, digamos. Oh, oh, Adriana, who was it? Ana Maria, right? No, este, solo. Yes. Este que se va a poner contractado siempre. Y si es. En el ejemplo así está. Entonces, si en el indicador. Uh, ah, okay. Digámoslo con contractual form. Ok. Ok. Questions. Yes, no. No. So, we are going to stop the class here. And I wish you a great rest of the night. Okay. See you tomorrow. Okay. Bye, you. bye bye. Take care. Bye. 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 bye.